Sue Great, one of the best premiership captains in the history of the game, a brandline medalist and the former coach of the Brisbane Lions. Please welcome Michael Voss. Yeah. Probably. Uh, it does probably need to be stated that that comb over if I had a bowl cut would be the in thing today. <laughs> <laughs> I was ahead of my time. You're good now, at Michael, yeah. grand finals, that's something that you know about. You led your, your club to three premierships. What would be going through the players' minds this week, you know, in comparison, Hawthorne, to the Fremantle boys? Well, first year to uh, the second or the third, it's somewhat different. Um, tomorrow night, I imagine the Fremantle players will start to wake up at about 2 a.m. in the morning and start to... Uh, that's where the second... Mm. Guessing coming in, don't want to play against the Norm Smith medalist. Don't want to make sure, I, you know, I've got to kick that goal that I need to be able to kick, whereas Hawthorne, they'll probably sleep a little bit easier. Mm, OK. Now, this week we, we, it was announced that the appointment of Justin Lepich as the coach of the Brisbane Lions. What was your thoughts on that? Well, Lepers, uh, it's quite ironic because uh, Lepers a good mate of mine, so mm. um, it was rather strange. I rang him and wished him all the best. and. Mm. Um, yeah, so it's, it is quite strange, but at the same time, you know, I wish him all the very best. I do want our club to succeed, yep. um, whether that's me or someone else. Well, it's Leper now, and I wish him all the best. Cool. I just want to touch on, um, back to Leper. Now, as you said, he's a good mate of yours. He's taken over, mm. taken over the job. So if he, if he gives you a buzz, I mean, you, you've built where that club's at. You've yep. been there for the last four or five years or whatever it's been. So, you know, you've developed these players, and they started to show a little bit um, towards the second half of the year, while you were still there, mind yep. you. Um, so if he rings you and asks you um, your advice, are you you're more than willing to, to help him out? Oh, absolutely. Um, yep. And, you know, have a, have a quick chat to him. Always always has. I've been there when he was uh, assistant coach somewhere else, and, you know, same if, uh, if it requires elsewhere. But, you know, he has had a good apprenticeship. He's had his time. And uh, the fact he's got his own club and the fact it's mine is really irrelevant. Yeah. Um, I shouldn't say it's not not mine. It's his. Um, so yeah, but but yours. certainly uh, you do go about it about they're your players yeah. because you've you've I've seen a lot of these guys from Daniel Rich onwards yeah. where they've come into the system and John O's been the OAS. I had Daniel Rich at the OAS. Um, so you know I've had a big part in their career. So it'll be hard not to watch them from exactly. here for sure. And Vossi, how does uh, how does your life look now without obviously uh, with the head uh, head coaching role? Are you going to go on and, and uh, look to go to other clubs or are you just happy what you're doing now and, and maybe go into the media? What, what are you going to do with the rest of your time? Oh, I don't know, but I want to figure out something pretty quick because <laughs> I get bored very easily, as you know, Jono, so yes. I need to be busy. Um, so the next challenge, so that's us for us as a family. We want to move somewhere else, new challenge, fresh start. Um, I would like to continue coaching. But, you know, at the same time, I'm just not going to go and coach just because um, I want to go to the right club and get developed the right way and, and learn also. Just, just quickly on that then, you've been in charge of a senior... Does the Melbourne Paul Ruse, under Paul Ruse... Um, has, have you been approached by them, or, no, is, or is that no, a consideration? No, well, no, 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 no consideration or no need at this point in time. Collingwood, yeah. Yeah. Collingwood. Oh well, keep running through the club. Just, <laughs> so, uh, hey, we'll Abel just Dull do Mikes. process of elimination <laughs> here, shall we? Don't want. Don't want. Yeah, yeah then, that's uh, a possibility. Come to yeah, Super Hots. League. Yeah, yeah. Man, I injured myself as soon as I walk out of the football field. Now, just going to ask you the question. I'm mean, just seeing some footage of you back in the Brisbane Bears, and he was there when the, the tough times. And just this probably question goes out to a lot of the GWS supporters as well. I mean, he went through some tough times. Not many. People in the crowd. Yeah. Are you surprised with Gold Coast? I mean, how quick they've come on. I mean, they've recruited Gaza. He's won the Brownlow uh, with the Gold Coast. I mean, they've really grown quick. Just with the GWS, I mean, have a lot of patience for supporters. I mean, you've been through yeah. that transition. Oh, I'd, I'd just be yeah. really patient. I mean, we were uh, we were 25 years, 144 games experience at the when we played in our first premiership. So that's. You know, when we talk about GWS and kids coming in, what are they, 21? Yeah. yeah. So we're, you don't rush it. They might get there a little bit early. I think Collingwood was the youngest team in the last, whatever, 12, 15 years are that's actually played. Are you a bit actually impressed with Gold Coast, how far they I mean, they're, they're only a couple of games out of the, uh, the finals, and this is their third season. Quite extraordinary. Yeah. Um, it is harder to go from that seven to that 12. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a big jump. Mm -hmm. And then when you're going from six to four, um, you've got another big jump. So it's mm -hmm. just not a simple step. And... What we had uh, you know, from 2001, we played in the 95 final series, 96, yeah. 97, played yeah. fine, missed 98, played in 99, played North Melbourne in the preliminary final, and you guys absolutely and 96, touted us. 96 yeah. at the same time, 2000 we yeah. played it. So this is the experience that we went through before we were ready. Yeah. So, you know, it does take a little bit of time.